Welcome to the channel everybody. This is Hardware Despair. My name is Ryan and today we are playing Card Survival Tropical Island. Let's do it. Now we are here, whoopsie, we're here at the um, wetlands. Yes, yes, we're living in the wetlands now. I did get some wonderful comments from a couple different folks and I don't think the wetlands is a great place for us to set up camp here. It's good to have the campfire here so we can boil up water when needed. Um, the kiln probably will finish that here as well. Um, now a shelter is probably something I should construct just in case we have to sleep while we're, you know, one or two nights while we're working through our mud and making pottery and stuff. But as it stands, I think the bay is our best bet now. Um, for sleeping, there's less bugs. We have access to the ocean, so we can always go swimming, uh, fishing for food and things like that, and swimming. But uh, let's see here. So that aside, I think we will spend a little bit of time here. For one thing, let's check out our injury. So I need to get this bandaged. I don't see... Well, I keep hitting the wrong button. I'm sorry. I don't see one of the bandage plants here in this location. Now, first things first, let's go ahead and fill up our water because it is raining. Whoops. Yeah, undo that 28 times. Beautiful. All right. Do we need some drinky drink? Uh, slightly thirsty. We'll drink one. Now, the problem is we're very, very hungry, so I probably should go ahead and start a fire while we're here. Let's do that, because we do have a goat fish on us. Um, also, do I have the trap set with some bait? Because those seeds can work. Okay, yeah, we do. All right, let me go ahead and get my dry leaves. I just saw them. There they are. We need to work on getting some more tinder. Oops, that's not the fire. All right, now we'll throw some sticks on there. Yeah. It's not really enough. Do I have anything but palm fronds? Well, we've got 31 of those, so a few of those will help. Now, let's get that fish on there. I don't know. I should have probably grabbed some ash out of that, but... Um, hmm. Yeah, the other slot we'll just have to leave vacant. Oh, wait, it does show two. Wait, we had two fish there? Oh, my God, I missed that. Yeah, I guess we did stack two. I remember catching two now. Okay, well, there we go. We're going to have a real good meal in 30 minutes. Um, now, here's an idea. Oh, we can cut wood from the wetlands jungle. Yep, I'm doing that. Beautiful. All right, cooking went up. Woodworking went up. Nice. But they're still very low. It's crazy just how much there is to this game. All right, so let's eat, because we are literally almost starving to death. Beautiful. I'm going to take the fish scraps, because we'll probably take those home and fish with them. Uh, oh, he's real stressed. I can't remember. I think it's probably because of his bug bites, for one. He's in minor pain, and I think he's also got nothing on his clothing, um, his bottom half, because his, his little grass skirt wore away. So I think when we get back to the bay... I'm going to go ahead and work on some clothing for him because he's going to, I think at the very least, we can replace his skirt. <laughs> uh, I don't know if that's actually what's making him stressed, but that might be the case. Who knows? It would stress me out if I was walking around uncovered. But uh, so for right now, I think we'll just let the fire burn out. I could explore more of the wetlands here, but um, honestly, I think we'll just grab our coconuts and go home to the bay for right now we'll come back and do deal with the uh, kiln and stuff a little bit later on i think let's see here because we need to get the stress level down i want to get my food situated although it's not terrible what do we need here 10 bricks it would be nice to get this thing constructed before we leave now i've got sand here so what i need is 10 things of mud we don't have any mud no. So let's go over here to the puddle. Let's see what, how much, 15 minutes. Let's see how many we get. Okay, that's respectable. Oh, nice. Right, let's try this mud puddle. Spread out the love. Okay, I just need one more. How's he doing? He's very heavy. He's hungry again, but that's okay. Let's do this last one. Of course, we're going to drop these once we get them. Make a mud brick. Yeah, I want to make them all. Damn. We're going to have to spend a lot of time doing this. And we don't have any food, but uh, yeah. So let me go ahead and make 10 mud bricks real quick, and we'll finish the kiln before we leave here. Oh, while I was sitting here doing it, almost done, the trap got triggered. It notified me, too. It dinged like there was food ready or something. What? It, what is it? Oh, I don't... Wait, did, is it on the ground? I think we might have missed whatever it was, because I don't have it. 
Well, that stinks. Let's rearm it. Yeah, it must have just got away. Oh, well. We got one more brick to do. I'll throw the fish scraps in there. Let's do the last brick here. I've been really just pushing him. Right, he's very hungry. He's dirty, too. So real quick, let's wash off. Yeah, that might help his stress a little bit, too. He's still very encumbered because we got all these bricks on us. So let's get those done. Fill required items. Build, please. Oh, God, that just took an hour and a half. All right, we got new... Yes, it's done, folks. It's done. Look at this. All these blueprints popping up. Oh, that's huge. In fact, I need to make sure I've actually got some research done here. Wow. That was a huge step, guys. I'm glad we actually took the time there. Oh, boy. So this is a tough one right here. After looking through some of the others here. Bellows. We'll probably need a bellows, but not right now. Actually, I'm not sure. We might. Bellows can use speed up temperature. Increases counts and fruits. Oh, maybe I should make that first, actually. that That's not a bad idea. But um, in addition to that, let's go ahead and research. It'll take a full day. The hard part is choosing over here. Do we go with clay vase, clay jar, or a cooking pot first? Oh, man, that's such a tough one. Uh, I think we might go with the vase eventually once we get to this point. But, yeah, for now, let's just focus on the bellows because that might be... How do we work? I should be able to relight it with some lit tinder. Okay, okay, so... I was wondering if we need to, like, combine it with the fire, but obviously not, so that's good. Okay, well, I think we can leave this area for now. We will be doing uh, a lot more mud and <laughs> getting clay going. I thought I had a piece of clay, but, uh, oh, well. Let me just grab the coconut shells, and we're heading home. Well, here we are, back at the bay. As you can see, I, I went ahead and cracked open one of the coconuts, got the meat out of it, because he is very hungry. He's also sleepy, though. We need to go ahead and sleep him. It's flashing up here at me, so I think I'm just going to eat. I wanted to do some fishing. As you can see, I've got the fishing line here in my bag. That food's not not great, but it's better than nothing. Sleep for what, I mean, before we go to bed. So I think we will go ahead and just sleep, and we'll, we'll get back to work in the morning. All right. Good morning, everybody. So we did not have to worry about any animals. It's kind of unfortunate. But the shelter's still in good shape, so no worries there. Let's see here. We got the aloe vera, clear palm. Everything's looking good over here on this side. It's very calm. Like his stress went down a little bit overnight. He did need. He does need to eat, though. And I don't really want to give him coconut right now. Also, we need to drink. Where's my water? I think I just passed it up. It's all the way back here. I brought ten of them because we were kind of heavy. What's in this? Oh, gosh. I got it. Oh, shoot. I should have left that bowl. Dang it. All right, I'll stick it back in here for now, but I need to get rid of that. Okay, that's good enough. We got the fish scraps. I'm glad I brought those back, obviously, because those need to be baited. Um, in fact, I think we're going to spend some time doing that. Once we uh, catch a couple fish, I'll start the fire there. Hopefully, we have enough tinder for that. Let's see here. The snake grass also needs to be processed. Um, I know we had a few leaves here, but oh my gosh. I just need to make sure I can start a fire here. Oh, I do have the coconut husk. We can start fires with that, can't we? Yeah, if I, if I process it. Where's my hand drill? All right, let me grab that. I just want to be ready. Because if we get fish, man, we are, because we're almost starving. But um, let's just start those fibers. I probably should process another coconut. Just for the fibers, if nothing else. And we can eat the meat. I'm gonna mm, I'm gonna dump the coconut milk. I found that the that the combination of the two is definitely not good for the stomach. I think we can eat the meat safely. He'll get a little bit annoyed probably by having too much of this, but it'll help us while we fish. All right, so yep, let's do it. Let's do a little fishing here by the sea. Oh, it just broke. It just broke. That's okay. I think we can fix it because I do have more fish bones. Or, I'm sorry, bird bones. Let's make a hook. And as I recall, we're going to need one more cord. Let me see if that's correct here. Where's our fish thing? Fishing line three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me actually look here. What else? What did we need for the... Oh, boy. Yeah, I don't have the rope right now, so let me look again here through this. Now, what about the fishing pole? Where's that? 
I thought we had it. Oh, no, we don't. Okay, I don't have it researched. That's okay. All right, we'll just do this then. Fill required items, just like I said. Need one more of those, so let me get that set up. All right, there we go. Let's build our hook and finally get some more fishing done here. Gosh, we're back to almost starving again. All right, it's a baited hook. Let's do it. He does enjoy this fishing, though. Hopefully that'll relieve some of his stress. Oh, I need to bait the hook. Oh, I'm not holding it there long enough. There we go. It's going to take him all day to catch something, it looks like. Man, oh, man. It's just a bad time to fish, I guess. Wow. We should try the spear. That was like three attempts and nothing. See, that only takes 30 minutes. No luck, though. Oh, boy. The baited line and everything. Oh, yeah, he really needs to eat something. He's complaining. Well, what do you want, buddy? You want some more coconuts? There we go. It's probably one of the reasons he's not, or he is so stressed out. Nice. All right, so that's a good start. I guess I will get the fire going because uh, why not, right? Okay, so the fish has 27 minutes to go. And let me see here. Now, I guess we'll just do, where's my spear? I don't need that now. Oh, wait. No, hold on. There's two pieces of meat. Oh, very nice. That's huge, actually. All right, let me see. Where's my other spear? Because that'll only take 30 minutes to spear fish. There it is. I do want to bait this hook with the fish scraps, though. Yep, 30 minutes. Perfect. Campfire. Finish cooking. No luck, though. But that's all right, because we've got quite a nice meal. Let's go ahead and eat those immediately. This guy's ravenous. That's barely probably going to barely hold us over until we can catch another one. We're just having terrible luck. Although I just noticed it's raining. Let's drink. Okay, we're fine on liquids. But I want to go ahead and make sure that these coconut shells all get filled up. Gorgeous. All right, back to the fishing. Our line is baited. Okay, we got ourselves a goatfish. If I was having more luck, I could kind of get ahead on this, and we could start doing that weaving I was talking about. That'll take 24 minutes. Can we get some more palm fronds here, please? Damn, I don't have any more palm fronds in this area. That's the one thing that stinks, is I can't really... I guess, can I go for a walk? Oh, yeah, we can. We can still continue to discover stuff. Cool. Even if we fully explored it. Just what we needed. All right. Oh, it's flashing at me. Are we done? No, okay, it's just telling me I discovered a sack. Wonderful. All right, nine minutes, poo. Um, oh, I'll probably have to husk a coconut, but that'll take like 15. Yeah, it's good enough. All right, there we go, take it out. God, it's already 5 p.m., can you believe that? Dang, another day. Okay, so we are pretty well fed. Not the best we could be, the fire's almost out, I'm just gonna let it burn out. We're gonna collect the small palm. Put that down. Where's my axe at? There it is. Yep. Beautiful. All right. Now we need to weave some of these together. I'm betting. Did I say 45 minutes? Damn. Okay. Uh, no, I don't need to open that. We have a couple of them. Now let's go to clothing, leaf skirt. Eight. Oh, wait, I didn't even need to weave them. That's okay. I'm sure I'll need to weave at some point, right? Uh, now I do need, obviously, some four cords. Yikes. Oh, you know what? I forgot. It's not these. But there is a way to... I think it's the snake grass. Grind? No. Extract fibers. There it is. Nice. Actually, let me put those in my bag. I need to find, oh, we uh, now the snake grass, I believe I found this at the uh, wetlands. So that's going to be pretty huge. Oh, it's getting dark. Is it too dark for us to make? Oh, it is too dark to weave. Darn it. It's raining pretty hard. Don't really have much else going on. So let's just drink a little bit. Yep, make sure we're fully hydrated. And I guess it's time for bed. Okay, 4 a.m., bright and early. Now, first things first, let's go ahead and get our um, little shelter repaired a little bit. Beautiful. Excellent. Now, food is going to become an issue, but I do want to get this skirt finished here. 
Like I said, I'm not sure if that's really what's one of the factors that's stressing him out, but it can't hurt. It can't hurt to get him fully clothed. So let's make some more of these here. Cordage. What did I need? Something like four of this? Okay, let's check that. Oops, crap. I just made that into a rope. Do you see that? I just wasted... No, I made it into a ball of yarn. I can divide it back into cords, though. Just wasted time, but uh, no worries. Okay, so let's go here. The water skin, I'm so tempted to just cancel this. Yeah, I'm going to cancel that. Um, so that's been sitting up there forever. All I need is fat, but we'll never get it until we go to the jungle. So there it is. That's what I want. All right, and let's build that, please. Beautiful. Nice. No, don't break it. Okay, he's wearing a skirt again. Very cool. Now, what else can we get him clothing-wise? Because that's the next thing. We built the kiln, so the next big task here in our journal is to build the loom. Um, also then to build a shed or a mud hut. So I want to kind of focus on this clothing still. Now let me drop the snake grass. Actually, I'm a little bit tempted to go ahead and process the rest of this just to have it ready. Oh, I didn't mean to grind it. Damn it. No. That's okay. Uh, we'll just drop that. Maybe we can make some tea out of this. Bugs don't like it. Oh. Can I eat it? Did it make me sick? I don't think he liked it, but actually filled him up a little bit. That's all right. Let's just drop it because I'm realizing now I don't have a lot of time to mess around with his food levels. We can go fishing again. Uh, I just certainly hope this doesn't take all day. Just to catch something. Okay, there we go. A little bit better luck. Let's get a few more of those, please. Please, sir. You're supposed to be a great fisherman. Nice. Okay, so we've got it. We've got the fishing pole ready. I really need to get that going because this guy is just going to become dependent on this fish. All right. 12 hours. Should be good. Now, let's keep going. Mm, actually, you know what? Since we have two fish, we should light the fire. It's right here. Might as well. And I think I do have some stuff to throw in there. There's some sticks. And I'll throw a little bit of palm frond in there. That's probably good enough. Goatfish, you go in there. All right, what are we looking at? 21 minutes. Where's my fishing spear? Give it to me. There it is. Let's do it. And 30 minutes. We got one. Oh, he's on a roll today. Boy, it's just really hit and miss, isn't it? I hope there's like a skill to this. I'm sure there probably is. There's a skill to everything in this game. All right. Beautiful. No luck, but hey. Take that out. Let's go ahead and eat. I'm filling this guy up. Okay, now we've got some good fish guts. Let's, let's drop her. Let's drop her on the ground. I'd love to get another bone knife and rustic spear going. I like keeping two of those with me. I feel like that's smart. First of all, I almost forgot about this, but... Ooh. That might be super close to infection right there. Actually, it might be infected with this here. I kind of forgot about it. Dang it. I shouldn't. It's sh it's literally flashing at me here. Um, do we still have ash? We might. We might. I can prepare up some lye if we do. Oh, please tell me we do. Yes. Okay, so let me put that there. And I've got plenty of water. Um, I'm not going to do it. Should I do it in the unsafe water? Yeah, okay, that'll work. That'll work. And we can dump that into the campfire. Not literally. 21 minutes. Let's do another spearfish. We might get lucky. We might get lucky. Yeah, we did. All right, now this is coming out. That's going on there. Oops. And I think 5% is probably long enough. So anyway, let's uh, worry about the most important thing, this macaw bite. Oh, look at that. It brought it down from 100% to 0.3%. That is huge. Oh, weird. Well, I just went fishing one more time while I waited for that thing to finish, and it says mouse damage. There are signs of mouse activity in the area. Some items were lost. Cook fish scraps. You know what that means? We need to set up a, a deadfall trap in this area. That's what that tells me. All right, let's take that out. Um, I don't see his food meter up there, so I'm just going to hold it. Now, he is stressed out. I guess the palm skirt didn't really help all that much but uh no worries i'm not i'm not regretting that we made it 
Now, what am I looking for? I'm looking for the large stone, which sometimes inhabits... There it is. Okay, so the heavy stone. We do have one. I think we also need four regular... No, no, that's wrong. Hold on. Let me look it up instead of trying to guess at it. Two sticks. We can get the sticks here. We can get the sticks. Hold on. I know how to get sticks. There we go. I got us some sticks. All right, let's get that done. Deadfall trap. Very good. Signs of mice activity in the air. They're eating our cooked fish scraps anyway, so we might as well take advantage of that. Um, yeah, all right. So we got a choice here. I could try and stock up more on fish, which isn't the worst idea because this stuff might last for a little while. This is at 97% still. We're very hot. Let's actually go for a swim. Oh, nice. Got some seaweed. This is what I want to do is get a little bit of food going, built up. Then we can maybe go back to the wetlands and actually do some, uh, like, uh, fire up this clay bowl I've got. See how that works. Uh, obviously, the bellows is done. That's something I almost forgot about. Let's see. Where was the bellows? Was here? No. Ah, hold on. Okay, well, shoot, we need a piece of fat for the bellows, so that was kind of a wasted research, but not really. Oops. Um, what I'll do is we'll just keep that in mind, and uh, that's probably more important than the other thing I needed fat for anyway. So what we do need to do is spend more time in the jungle, I think, if we want to hunt that boar and get some fat off of it. That's what I, my understanding is. Boy, we are very hot. Well, that's all right. I think it's about time to head back to the wetlands. Oh, before we go, I was just thinking, man, some shoes would be nice for him, too. And I think we can do this. Fiber cord. We can definitely do the cord. I don't know about the husk. I don't think I have another coconut here. Uh, like a husked one. One with the husk on it. No, we don't. Darn it. Well, I can go for some walks on the beach to find that, because that's really worth it. Oh, wait, no. Here, we do, we do already have a palm tree. You, see, it's hurting my feet just to do that continue beautiful strip that nice um now i believe we do need one more cord so let me process this one we'll do one cord now we'll get this coconut beautiful get out of my inventory now okay very good how's our thirst i think we need to drink and then i'm gonna make us some shoes okay these look like the funniest shoes anybody's ever worn but it'll only take an hour let's build them Pretty sweet. Okay, let's put those on. How's our wound doing? I, it's almost done healing, so I hope we're going to be okay. It's just a bite from a monkey. Okay, so what's in our satchel again? Ah, we still got that sago flower. I'm going to hold on to that. Um, now we are good to go. I haven't forgotten. I've still got this unfired clay bowl. So let's chill with that. But um, we are doing good. And it looks like we can keep wearing stuff, so that's important. This poor fancy necklace is at 30 percent we could break it if we needed it but i don't think so so i know we i said we we're going to the wetlands but it's pretty late so we might end up just sleeping for the night but that's okay look at how our condition is doing now temperature normal weight we're doing fine now we finally got caught back up and he's not stressed anymore it doesn't look like i think just hanging out here at the bay is what really did it so let's go for another really relaxing night in our shelter and then we're going to go into the bug infested jungle <laughs> oh man more mouse sign dang oh here we go come on baby yes uh, oh a new blueprint oh that's it we just discovered it Oh, we can do this. Four fiber cords. Can I go in and break the little fishing line I've got? That's probably not a bad idea. Oh, I can't. Oh, that's okay. We can probably just use it until it breaks, but I'd rather just build a brand new one. All right, so we got the bird meat. Um, I'm going to hold on to this stuff. We're going to put this. Actually, this is at 67%. Let me eat that. Drop those fish scraps for the little mousy. Let's put this stuff in our backpack. I'm going to put that away. We're going to take that with us. So I'm not going to worry about the fishing rod now. I'll just leave this up here to remind myself because we are headed to ye old wetlands. Now, I do want to look at, real quick, woven hat would probably be really handy. Yep. Mm, look at these leather shoes. Those would be probably better than the coconut shoes. But, yeah, we're fine for now on our shoes. That's really good. All right, I do want to get this loom built, too. I don't remember where that was. 
Yeah, we still... We could build it. Let's see here. Long sticks, fiber cord. That's not bad. It might be a two-parter, though. Let's see. Just like the kiln, we should probably do a little bit of, you know, preparation before we go. I'm going to set up this loom, I think. That'll help us actually advance to the next level in our journal, too. So, might be worth the effort. Okay, well, it took me actually a while to get these long sticks, but I just had to go on several walks to find the small trees, and we're good. We can build our loom. Ah, as I thought, there's going to be two different levels here to this. Darn it, darn it, darn it. Um, so we need three more long sticks, and the fiber cord's not the end of the world, actually, but I have run out of snake grass, so I think we'll just pause the loom for now. It's time to head on. If I'm planning on going to the wetlands, we pretty much have to do it now. Now, I've got a whole bunch of food with me, and I think I might take a couple of coconuts along, too for the ride, so to speak. Now, everything else is pretty good. My backpack is full. I'll show you when we get there what that's got in it. So, all right, I think we're set. The only thing I'd like to do is maybe bring some palm fronds because I do want to set up a shelter, but we can probably find some of those. So let's just head to the jungle. And no, no, oh, he took a little foot damage, but not much, not much. I was going to say no foot damage, but he did take some. Uh, let's just see what we've got going on here. Ah, the snake grass. Yeah, that's one thing. I'm going to harvest a little bit of that. Just leave it on the floor. Also, I'm going to harvest some of this. And I do want to take that with me, but we'll leave it for now. Because we're coming back through here. So, let's go to the wetlands. Beautiful. Here we are. Kiln should be set up. There it is. Beautiful. Alright. Now, no bellows. Oh, we do have a bunch of palm fronds. Hey, maybe we can just go ahead and build our thing right now. We probably don't have the sticks for it, but let's check it. Alright, it's under shelter. We're getting there. Okay, we'll leave that one up here because I do want to build that. All right, what do we got? Mushrooms, unsafe water. We got our own snake grass here. Ah, we do have a couple small trees. I'm glad I brought the axe with me. Nice, so there's one. What did it say we need? Two more. Okay, so I think I'm going to get the fire started because I get this crab and this bird meat we can do. And I'll just drop the coconuts. Let me go ahead and empty out too because I'm getting pretty heavy. I don't need to do that. Um... That's coming out. Wait a second. Maybe I should take this thing off. That's probably the best way. Yeah, let's take that off first. And now I can... Ooh. Oh, okay, that's fine. That worked. Just dropped it on the ground, but that's fine. Okay, so let's go ahead and eat this. Munch that down. Eat that, and bring that on board, leave that on the floor. Okay, I brought a bunch of these leaves, too, from home, uh, because these things eventually turn into dried leaves over time, which is obviously what I'm going to need to start the fire. Dang it, I keep turning stuff into yarn. <laughs> All right, let's leave those. We're going to need those. All right, where's my fire drill? Beautiful. All right, lit tinder in the house. Now, I'm going to get this fire stoked up a decent amount here where's my sticks there there uh, i actually don't want sticks i want wood beautiful two bird meats going on the fire that's 24 minutes now let's see what we can do here i do want to start this up but do i have enough mud let's make clay that's a 30 minute process wow okay take that get the crab on the fire that's going to be 24 minutes. Um, how's our food? I'll just hold on to it. So, we've got a little clay. I also have this bowl somewhere. I think it's worth just experimenting with it. What did I do with the bowl? There it is. All right, let's just see what happens. I think it's got three slots, though, for different things, but um, we'll see. Now, I need my flint and tinder again. Hand drill. Hope we got more leaves. We do. Whoopsie. Oh, look, I like that. Oh, now I'm just realizing what this is for. This just kind of helps you sort out so you don't have to sift through everything on the ground. <gasps> oh, that is so helpful now that I realize what that is. Okay, at first, I, when I first started playing, I was baffled by what this was. But now I realize totally. So this is just exactly what I need. Cool. Now I can fill it up a little bit. Um, I better hold off on the palm fronds. And that's good. Okay, let's go back. Let's put that in there. Look, four hours. 
Oh my God, I got to keep this thing lit for four hours? Okay, well that tells me, yeah, before I get this thing started and we get serious about firing up clay stuff, we need to get a whole mess of wood going, don't we? Yeah, I can tell that's, that's going to be the next step then before we actually get going on it. Oh my gosh, guys. Well, thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you've enjoyed the progress we've made. If so, hit like and subscribe for me. Check the description down there for all the different links, and I will see you guys on the next episode.